Hello everyone, here I am uh, watching the morning forest stream and I'm pretty tired. I don't know what I've done but I've started to sleep funny which makes this muscle back here like hurt me the entire day. But uh, today we are looking in on Mindy that just moved into university. And here she is, she has just gotten her finances in order and um, I don't know if we should fix her makeup or anything. I haven't been noting people's uh, favorite colors but she aged up into young adult into this sporty type of situation. <laughs> I think her room is over here. She has nothing. We could give her a dresser, I think. Why do we keep the dressers over here? Do you also find yourself clicking it straight in the middle of the miscellaneous <laughs> symbol where there's nothing, so you can't click there? Well, I do. Let's just switch that thing out. Also, Mindy has a bit of money, so wait. Let's just note how much money there are now. I feel like a, a bed of some sort would be a good investment for her. Um, maybe this one. She had a very bohemian style before she aged up and now she's wearing all sporty stuff. I love the customization <laughs> in The Sims 2, but I always, always feel like I have too few bedspreads. They're, they're, they're never sufficient. Um, you know what, I'm, I'm just gonna go with this one. No, it looks like it's for old people. Maybe I changed the bed altogether. Maybe this is the one. I don't like the squares. <laughs> no matter what bed I choose, it, it looks bad. Oh my goodness, What? how much money was that? We cannot spend 3,000 on, on a bed. Let's have this one instead. Yeah, she, she went on Ikea and, and just uh, got a bed. Uh, yeah. <laughs> It's funny, I didn't check that it was from Ikea, but I had an Ikea vibe, so I just... Now we're left with 31.54. So, oh, how handy. She spent 500 on that, so we're gonna just withdraw 500 from her bank account. So then uh, she wants to gain a skill point, and she needs body and cleaning for her undeclared major. So I'm just gonna have her... Plan outfit every day to see what is available. See if we can find something that is a little bit more her because I'm not feeling that this is what she has been so far. And then we'll also change her appearance. Okay. <laughs> well, this is way better. I think I'm gonna leave her with this because it's it's way more her. It's not exactly right, but uh, she had this hairstyle and it's it's fine. It's a good hairstyle. But I want to see, oh god no, I want to see if we can put her in something a little bit different and see that doesn't work. Like these are the clothes and hairstyle almost exactly I have Lucy Bourbon in, in the Pleasant View save. So I feel like that isn't really right. Oh no. <laughs> she has quite an interesting uh, appearance, doesn't she? Maybe it's something like this actually look good. Oh, there's no <laughs> regret button. I have regrets. She looks quite good in this, I think. Is there one with green hairband? <laughs> All right. Well, we'll have to... Oh, man, I wish I could zoom in. I'm gonna make this bigger when I uh, edit this, but for me it's very small <laughs> on the screen. Absolutely not. Oh no. This works really well for her. I'm gonna keep that. I think I download this. No, it says glitter by Vide. Did I? I don't think I did this. I think this is a recolor of someone else's stuff. And I was being a brat and didn't credit them. <laughs> I think. What? Well, does blue work even? Oh no. Well, I think that was the best. I like this one. But I wanted it to be green somehow. I feel like she she wouldn't... This is quite good. I don't think she would be ve wearing heavy makeup, but then again, that's what I put on her. So so maybe she would. Uh, um, and now we can try all the hairstyles again. See if they look better with, with makeup on. This is a quite good hairstyle in general. This is quite 
wrong. I actually feel like maybe she like chopped her hair off and changed her style a little bit. Uh, do we? Did I put any blush on? She has quite pronounced cheekbones. Um, it, yeah, I think I, I'm gonna leave her like this and this is now her new look and I think we did quite good. It's dark, but finally I can zoom. Now for that uh, skill point, I think we're gonna start with the cleaning. So study cleaning. When does she have 1 p.m.? Okay, so we have quite a lot of time. And while she's doing that, I'm gonna check what all the other ones are doing. This sim is building skills on her own. Uh, so I'm just gonna let her do that. Cute. Oh, he, I don't think she is cute. Okay, but he wants to marry Jackie, so that might not work out too well. What I do is I I tend to lock either power ones like this because I think uh, I think that was intriguing for the story of the neighborhood, or I go on um, Pleasant Sims rules of only studying and such uh, if they have the want for it. Now Anton has. Um, filled his meter up quite well so he doesn't actually have to study so that's probably why I uh, did this. Should we have a party? I think we should have a, a house party. Oh no. He wants to join the Greek house and so does someone else. Uh, Elizabeth here. She for some reason she hasn't got any wants um, so I think it's appropriate to throw a toga party. <laughs> That's my point. She wants to write a term paper and also gain a skill point and I think she should start with the skill point because it's better uh, if you have this meter up here. So, and she also wants to learn cleaning. So, study cleaning. They are doing quite well, uh, these other sims. So, Anton is going to invite uh, who he likes, like this. No matter who that was, because I keep doing that. I don't. I don't even check. Well, if he likes Mindy so much, then maybe I should have them speak to each other later. But right now, she's studying, and he wants to get engaged to Jackie. What is their relationship? It's very good. So maybe he just uh, flirt a little bit with her, hold her hands. <laughs> I mean, he is in college, so they're not gonna... She's already engaged, right? To Peter. So how, how, is, how is he gonna do that? <laughs> but he's not gonna marry her anyway if this is there in college, because uh, that would mean he would move out and we don't want that. <laughs> Who's available for answering the phone? There you go. Yeah, all right. He's very interested in everyone. He's a family sim, so he wants to find himself a wife. Can we even propose? No. <laughs> I don't think we can. So you can just like try and make out with her. I mean, their re relationship couldn't be any better. Um. So if he doesn't have, if he doesn't have the option to convince her to leave her fiance, then I guess we don't have that option. Maybe that option is just for when they're married. That doesn't make much sense to me. Oh well. Well, Mindy is starting off really good. Oh now, oh now she wants to woohoo in bed. Um, I was listing everyone's uh, aspiration and their star signs and what they should have <laughs> according to Pleasant Sims list. And, and Mindy is a family sim because that's what she randomized what, when she uh, grew up. But she is actually a true pleasure aspiration sim. So <clears throat> if she gets the option to, to change her aspirations, she's gonna change the pleasure. How does she already have five want slots? That's weird. Oh well. I usually let them continue studying until they stop by themselves. That way I don't have to wait for a new want. Um, but there's a party going on. Well, uh, the fact that she is a true pleasure sim is 
probably why she wants to boohoo in bed, or it's because she uh, just aged up and is eligible <laughs> to, to woohoo with. She also wants Jacke to go to college. I think they have a pretty good relationship. Yeah. Oh, and apparently th she thinks that Glenn Perla is the most hot. Uh, human alive uh, next to Anton. She has three balls with these people. That's unusual. Oh dear. <laughs> what are you doing? So Elizabeth just tried to kiss Anton and it's not going well. Oh no. Why did you do that? <laughs> she just got, went, well, he's hot. I'm just gonna try and kiss him. <laughs> And he was just, uh, no, I have a girlfriend. So weird. Well, how do you join the Greek household? To join the Greek household, click on the phone and choose Greek house. Then join and then the lot name of the house you seem would like to join. Or click on any Greek member and choose ask to join Greek house. Your sim will need to build a relationship with several Greek members before they can become members. I'm not sure that's doable because I'm not sure they are a Greek house. Do I need to create one? I don't know how to do that. Click on the phone, choose Greek house. There is no Greek house option. So if you call college, they tend to give you a list of what is available. Like who is there and whatnot. So maybe we could do that. We have the campus directory, but who would be in the Greek house? We don't know. Oh, I suspected to would it to be a student and he is. I didn't know students went and became roommates. Well, who knows? What she can just call this person yeah. and invite them over, I don't know. Tina here also wants to woohoo in bed, but she also wants to gain a charisma skill point. Well, who does she think is hot? Can we scope the room and see if we find someone? No, no one was hot. <laughs> she prefers males. So maybe she has talks to this professor uh, for now. It's always good to have a good relationship with professors. They might give you a better grade, I think. According to the rules, we don't change their major until they have a want for a major. Uh, everyone here has a major, except for Mindy, <laughs> because she just got there. And she is like an expert in cleaning now. Okay. Oh, Elizabeth, you shouldn't have done that. <laughs> oh, she's so sad about it. And he's talking about Jackie being cute. Okay. Let's just see if something else happened in this party if we leave them to their own devices. It is pretty late, they should be going to bed. Jackie has apparently decided to pretend to play chess and when he actually put the pieces out she goes, no, I'm not interested in that. No thank you. Well, this is a pretty good party. Congratulations on hosting a terrific party. Your guest had a fantastic time. I just have to research a little bit about that Greek house. Yeah. In order to join a Greek house, uh, there must be a Greek house. And since there are <laughs> no students to spare, uh, we, we can't do that. At this point, I'm not gonna do any Greek houses and I'm gonna, just gonna uh, unlock the, the want for Elizabeth to join a Greek house because she's not going to there. But she wants to woohoo in bed and call uh, Aina over. Well, what is her uh, orientation? We need to know. Uh, she is really straight. <laughs> it's in the middle of the night so, so they can't invite anyone over. I'm not gonna lock anything for her right now. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Mindy finally decided to stop studying. Now she wants to use the toilet and she can't because it's busy. She will just have to wait. We'll let Tina get her charisma skill points. Anton just wanna tell people to do stuff and... Hustle pool. He does not know how to clean anything. Maybe this is a good time for her to actually write this term paper that she wants to write. College. Write term paper. Who has a computer? Oh, she has a computer. Why use everyone else's then? <laughs> Oh, she thinks Tina is hot. I did not know. She is bi, apparently. Okay. 
The place really got trashed when they had a party, but it, it's fine. Elizabeth is apparently cleaning everything up. Linda wants to be friends with Anton, and so I think I'm gonna try and do that. She also thinks he's very hot, but uh, let's just try and chat with him first and see what happens. Yeah, I really put a lot of makeup on her. Oh, I'm sorry that just happened. They seem to be getting along really well. That's awesome. Don't think we haven't noticed your enthusiasm in games, Miss Mindy. As a small reward, please feel free to journey to Games of Glory where gaming is king. Okay. Yeah. We might do that. <laughs> she has became friends with Anton and now she wants to gain a skill point and since she needs a body skill points I'm gonna use this bike over here try and do that it is morning so I think Anton will probably call Yaki over and see if she wants to have a date on the lot see if he desperately wants to get engaged with her they're gonna be here so that time passes <laughs> he doesn't have claws until 6 p.m. apparently. Mm. Oh dear, Elizabeth has a final exam in one hour. Not attending the final exam will hurt Elizabeth's grade for the semester. Don't be late. I think she's about to go. Uh, she doesn't have the ability to raise her grade any, so sh this is where she is going to end up but it's fine she's going to pass so that's okay mindy has gained a body skill point from the exerto super exercise machine i have heard that they might keep sitting on this machine even though they get very hungry so i'll watch her yeah i think she should be getting off that one <laughs> she wants to reach cleaning level six i'm gonna lock it in even though it doesn't really um, benefit her but she also wants to invite Jacke over so let's just do that and then is there any food here aren't you cooking food for us eat these ships i guess <laughs> now how's this date going it's going well he wants to talk to her a little bit Jacke says it's always a pleasure to see you i'll be right over what's wrong with you oh you're hungry too okay well what do you can we like ask him to cook our meal oh she already wants to pick a major she wants to declare the culinary literally blah, the culinary literature major okay well since that is what she wants to do we are going to college and declare major and this is a risky move because right now she has this meter full here but once she declare major it will change what is um, required so it might be good oh she is afraid of declared a political science major well don't do that then <laughs> oh she's very tired too okay well Jackie is here you should like greet him but declare major first why are you thinking about babies we don't have enough fish in stock to keep making this dish oh okay um uh, call delivery apparently we have food missing a food shortage groceries and she wants to declare culinary literature major that means she can she can be in <laughs> a music career what is it her lifetime what i don't even know adventurer entertainer criminal slacker or show business her lifetime one is to graduate three children from college i don't know if this changes sometimes currently that is what she wants and luckily she's still on a good path to have a good grade she wants to complete freshman year um i'm gonna lock that in i think she also wants to become friends with anton anton is on a date <laughs> and he's eating pancakes where's his date uh on the toilet oh, okay <laughs> and we are buying groceries we have lots of money so let's let's just i don't think we actually had a food shortage it, it was just a shortage of fish okay since you're doing errands like do stuff mindy has class in one hour let's make sure she goes what are you doing now don't go to sleep go to class <laughs> she is very tired but she can sleep later 
What are you doing? Hey, did Elizabeth get back? I mean, I, I suppose so. She is... <laughs> oh no. Well, I have to check the footage. I need to know how much money she got. Otherwise, I can't deal with this. So I'm just gonna save this. The benefit of recording yourself. <laughs> doing everything. So we can see here that... Stop it. Be nice to me. Elizabeth has met all the requirements to become a senior. Elizabeth finished the semester with a grade of C+. As a result, the school has given Elizabeth a grant of 500, which is very handy because that's the fee, so she doesn't need to fix her bank account or anything. It's time to focus on only one area of study for graduation. Elizabeth can no longer change majors, and she has gained enough life experience to be able to lock up to two ones in the Wants and Fear panel. Uh, that's awesome so but i think like it's no these these people are going to be they're going to be uh, townies anyway so it doesn't matter that they don't have any money because otherwise they will end up in the sheep sheepo apartments but i'm just gonna make them townies when they grow up so it's totally fine but if if they should get um, grants or anything that like exceeds 500 uh, I will put it in their bank accounts just in case we marry them later or something who knows Lama. but uh, we're going to mark her like the way I handle the spreadsheet when my sims are in college is a little bit different so she is now in year four and this means we are increasing her age by one and we are changing only her days or sim years to play to two and marking her as in year four so now she's like not in sync with the other ones but that's fine once we get everyone to two here they're not gonna pass each other unless i take them to to community lots and i'm trying not to do that if we go to a community lot we might leave elizabeth at home just to get her more in sync with the other ones can we also talk to the delivery guy? No? We can tip him. Tip him one dollar. <laughs> She's stinky. What, what just happened? What just happened? Where is everyone? What did you do? How did I miss this? Why she didn't do anything? She just... They didn't woohoo or anything. This is weird. But they, they went into the bed together. Uh, and Jackie is not happy about it. Got caught cheating on Jackie. Oh no. <laughs> uh, well then this... Um, I think she's gonna be hitting him, him up. Oh my goodness. On their date too? I forgot they were on a date. I'm so bad at this game. <laughs> this is a horrible date. Listen, don't think you'll ever call me again this was without a doubt the worst date i ever had i feel like i need a shower or something i'm gonna um unlock the go get engaged part because i don't think he will be able to now and jackie well you are already engaged to someone else so see now he's available <laughs> for mindy <laughs> because they they like each other he wants to gain a skill point. Does he need one? No, he doesn't. So I'm I'm gonna lock this one because he can only lock one want. I saw her going to the bed, but I was I just figured she wanted to sleep in the bed. <laughs> I didn't think she would do anything else. Well, okay. What are you doing? Uh you have your own room. Maybe you should try and be in your own room. The trouble with not locking your door is that people get inside <laughs> everyone else has locked their doors uh, we should they have this crappy little sofa here we should put a, like a bench outside too like just in case if, if we have some benches here uh, if if someone wants to like ACR woohoo <laughs> they can there nice huh <laughs> <laughs> you were tired. Just have a sleep. She wants to do an assignment and write a term paper. So I'm gonna lock the term paper and see if we can do the assignment. Just to get this meter here up a little bit. <laughs> oh, would you look at this? <laughs> Yaki comes over with a present. She is going to leave us a present outside the door. How nice of her. <laughs> Oh, no, no, don't, 
put it on fire? That's not good. Well, I think that's for you, Anton. So, uh, you, you can just stomp that out. Oh, view it first. I don't know. And then stomp it out, I guess. Let's see what it is. What is this? Dear Anton, the date we shared was worse than bad. This, it was the worst I've ever had. So angry slaps, an angry slaps too good for you. So have this flaming bag of poo. Oh, she did it on rhyme that too. Oh. Yeah, I guess that wasn't something good. Now he needs a shower. <laughs> Elizabeth has class in one hour. You, you better go then, I guess. She can finish the assignment instead. I think um, you don't really have to go to class, but maybe she can do both. How long is she in class for? Until 3 p.m. Okay, it's like half an hour left. Tina wants to gain a cleaning skill point, which is lucky because she uh, needs them. She's quite tired, so maybe she should sleep first. Who's this? Is this Tina? Yeah, we need to update her uh, project or I won't know who's who. So, let's claim door. Minda met Professor Sandel in class today and Professor Skacke. <laughs> okay. She has two beds in here. Why? I don't know. And a computer. Well, lock your door and sleep, I guess. How much do you get for one of these beds? You don't get much. That's probably why I don't sell it. But then this means that if we have an extra student, we could move them in here with Tina, I guess. Someone is in my bed. <laughs> oh, she's really miserable. Wait, what is happening? Come on, are you two very attracted to each other? Just in, in general. But he doesn't want to sleep in her bed <laughs> with her. Okay. I think Anton and Tina might have been involved earlier. Oh my goodness, he was engaged to Tina and then he was unfaithful to her with Jackie and wanted to marry her instead. And that's why they broke up. Okay, but then, <laughs> but then he got involved with Elizabeth. Like, Anton, what are you doing? Like, I think just the college years are um, turbulent. That's just what it is. Anton has class in one hour. Let's make sure he goes. He is. Mindy is starving to death, almost. Why do you pick that one to eat? Well, do that <laughs> so you don't starve and then... Is he cooking food? You could drink that instead of the rotten chips. Also, here's some nice, nice spaghetti over there. Eat that. <laughs> it's very important you eat the right thing. Now Tina has class in one hour, stop sleeping. We have 15 hours to go until the final exam. Um, I don't think it's going great, but it's also not going terrible. The benefit of sleeping with your face inside the food like this is uh, if you wake up because you're starving, you can just start eating. Now they have bills. And what I do is if they wouldn't have enough money to pay the bills, I just give them the money because everyone just uh, pays their 500 as in a fee and if that's not enough then the government steps in. It is a bit unfair because, uh, well it isn't really, everyone can move in everywhere. Is Tina available to talk? Uh, I don't know, is she? No, she's in class but we can say yes, that, that way no one else calls. <laughs> that's what I usually do. It's nice with some dinner conversation. Oh. We are very stinky. <laughs> Carita is going around thinking everyone is hot. Alright, so <laughs> Tina is very... Uh, she needs to pee, but uh, Carita had to... <laughs> oh no. She had to have some fun, so we got in a hurry. And I'm gonna have her study. Oh dear, the university examinations office has scheduled Carita's final exam to begin in five hours. Don't be late. All right, and all of these are going to have an exam in five hours. So let's try and keep track of that. Like if four plus five is nine. So maybe you stop playing games then. Her term paper is 97% done, so she really should be doing it. Why Why isn't she doing it? I don't know. Let's try and have a snack first then. Hurry up, you only have five hours to do it. How's everyone doing? See, Anton's study level is really low, but they usually um, increase quite a lot while on the exam if they're feeling well. Mindy is the same as him. 
And yeah, Tina too. She actually wants to do an assignment. She, she also wants to write a term paper. But she hasn't even started, so I don't think there's time. And I think it's more beneficial for her to sleep than to do an assignment. I hope I'm right about these things. But nobody's on probation, so it's fine if they fail. There, she finished the term paper. Get it as defeated twin demons of procrastination and distraction to finish a term paper, which will boost Karina's grade for this semester. That's fantastic. Now she can do whatever. I think everyone can do whatever. Three hours left. Well, since Mindy is up and Anton wants to be friends with her, he can go and talk to her. <laughs> oh no, and Tina is in a bad mood, mood and won't go to the final exam unless you do something quickly. How do I do this? College, go to final exam. I think the other ones, they will go on their own. Everyone's going. Anton has gained enough life experience to change aspirations. Would you like to change his aspiration? And we always click yes. Uh, and now we need to also check. His true aspiration is family. He's already a family sim, so we're just gonna leave him like that. But I usually, I regenerate these. The reason for me doing the, this is I feel like going to college changes you. <laughs> <laughs> like all that education and everything. Wait, so we have six pages, but the last one is just two. So we have five times six plus two is like that. 32 then four. So he likes formal wear and 13. Jewelry, 22. He does not like charismatic people. <laughs> okay, because why? Does he think they're lying to him? Also, Carita can do that. And her true aspiration is knowledge and she's already a knowledge sim she likes mechanical and <laughs> full face makeup i'm not who has that i'm not gonna do that nobody has that 11 she likes glasses and she doesn't like uh fitness okay oh no that didn't sound good well i'm gonna have to note everything down now so oops Anton has met all the requirements to become a junior. Anton finished the semester with a grade of C-. As a result, the school has given Anton a grant of 300. So he owes 200. So I'm just gonna note that. Owes 200. Remember that junior year is the last opportunity to change majors. Okay. And then we have Carita has met all the requirements. She got a grant of 500. So she is fine. Um, we don't have to change her finances at all. Mindy has met all the requirements to become a sophomore. Mindy finished the semester with a grade of C minus. As a result, the school has given Mindy a grant of 300, so she also owes 200. That last semester just didn't go too well and Tina is on academic probation. Another semester like this and Tina will be expelled for sure. Uh, see, that was because she didn't, she wasn't in, in a good mood when she went to, to the final exam. Uh, as a result, the school has given Tina a grant, no grant for the coming semester. So Tina owes 500. Is everyone back now? Yes, I believe so. Now we can sync their ages. So Anton is 20 years old and in his third year. And Carita is also in, this, in her third year third year so she is now also 20 years old and in her third year Mindy is in her second year so she is now 20 years old and Tina is also 21 years old and she is still in year three but she is on probation now we just gotta settle everything Tina owes 500 does she have a bank account I do not think so and she doesn't have a loan jar, so we need to buy one of those. This way she can borrow 500 and we set the, I think we set the interest rate to three, that is fine. And we put it in her inventory. So that's settled. She has a loan of 500. Mindy owes 200, but she has a bank account, so she could just withdraw 200. Anton also owes 200. He doesn't have a computer, so he, she, <laughs> he will have to wait for Mindy to fix her money first. Mindy now has 8,800 in her bank account and owes nothing. 
So now Anton can... Oh, he doesn't have a bank account. So he will have to... He has a loan jar. I have already fixed this apparently. So he can borrow 200. Uh, there's not no option for that. How annoying there. So now his loan is... 700 apparently <laughs> there Mindy's first year in college is done and since one year in college is two days I'm spending one episode on just one college year so this means that we, I'm going to leave you now and you will have a super duper time until next time uh, stay safe click all the YouTube buttons and take care bye bye